the form in a big robot. My username is Galaxy Star 24810, and I'm a beginner game developer. One day, I was making a hangout place for my friends that would consist of lots of free models I found cool. I was looking for a script that would make the ambient change colors, but every time I chose one, it would either be a cheap outdated script that doesn't work anymore, or not even a script at all. I was looking for an ambient color changing script for minutes, until I found this one script named something like, Ambient Script, which for some reason had random sets of letters and numbers next to it. I decided to use the script because I was so tired of clicking through all sorts of ambient scripts, and play tested my place. While testing the place, it was running normally for a few minutes, until the ambient color turned black and the time changed to night instead of day. It then began to rename every single humanoid figure to names like, Ruffle, Infected, Virus, and other virus names like that. The terrain color turned gray, black fog was seemingly added despite the place having no fog at all, and the moon image changed into an eyeball. The infection went as far as renaming every single humanoid figure again with ha ha ha, inserting random screen GUIs that showed inappropriate pictures, and inserting random infected models, causing the game to lag. The screen GUIs then showed pictures of child pornography, and decapitated people which were both uncensored, and turned every icon in Roblox Studio into a skull. This was the time I began to freak out, and tried to close down Roblox Studio, but there was a problem. I couldn't close Roblox Studio at all. I tried to close it down normally, close it down with Task Manager, and even went as far as trying to uninstall the app, but it just wouldn't let me. Every NPC in the place then began to die, and my avatar's face changed into a realistic hollow-eyed human, and Studio finally began to freeze. I thought this was the end of the strange happening, and I was finally able to close it down. Upon doing that, I got terrified when I noticed that my background had changed into an extremely gory picture of a woman's head hanged up to a hooked chain, and all of my apps I've ever installed on my computer had their icons changed into pictures of a head of an eyeless doll. I then realized that this wasn't just a casual Roblox Studio virus, it was an actual virus. Pop-pop tabs then spam my screen and displayed pictures of either child porn or decapitated people, and played an audio clip of somebody screaming. Red Japanese text then flooded my screen, to where my computer can't even handle it. I then tried to turn off my computer, but I couldn't. I tried to turn off my computer with the Windows Start menu, but my mouse couldn't move. In fact, everything couldn't even work at all. It all came to an end when everything went blank. The apps disappeared, the pop-pops went away, and the background was just black. To me, it looked like my computer was off because it happened in an instant, until I saw a pop-pop window of a video of somebody's room. It was all compressed and low quality. There was then a box that appeared in the corner of the video which showed my face. I quickly found out that I was in a video call, so I hid my face. A man who wore dark clothes and a grainy voice then walked into the screen, and tried to invite me into a special video. I was 12, and I perfectly knew what he meant by special. I then freaked out, and tried to find a heavy object to smash my computer, as I didn't really know another alternative. I then found a trophy I earned back at 5th which I had on my shelf, and smashed my computer to bits. Hours later, my dad came home from work, and came to check on my room. I was lying down pretending to sleep, but when he yelled out why my computer was in pieces, I reacted as if I just woke up. I then got grounded for months, and never got my own personal laptop ever again. I'm currently using my friend's computer to share you my story, 